We have a cluster of the earthquakes and seismic activity, should we call it, at the little island of LD, off the shore of the Reconnaissance Peninsula. Uh, of course, this is not just this rock. There is a pattern of the, you know, uh, oceanic ridge beyond that, and this is where the red dots are. They are showing the earthquakes in the range of 2, 2.1, 2, 3, in the Reconnaissance uh, Ridge area. This is where the Mid-Atlantic Ridge is opening up and creating, and through the bodinage process, sausage making, this pattern of the si volcanic systems in the Reconnaissance Peninsula. The waves uh, of this seismic activity in the past, we noticed that when they arrive, they start from the west in the Reconnaissance Ridge and then come on shore in the Reconnaissance Peninsula and cause uh, at least the past three eruptions that we have seen in the December, January, and uh, February this time. Uh, this is cuisine. We'll uh, create, uh, as if moving the magma, creating the breakage, actually, for the magma to rise. And this uh, makes pathway for the magma from the mantle, rise through the blocks of the fault lines, uh, through the crush zone in the fault lines, I should say, upward, which leads to eruption. Movement of the magma we can see, and when it erupts in the surface, of course, as everybody can see that. This is Fagodesvia, for example. It happened in 2021, in the March. And this was one single vent, so it had everything to had to erupt from that. It looks dramatic, but compared to a volcano like Damovan Klechevskaya or uh, the Popocatawa, that's quite a small. I have several videos uh, explaining about more in detail about the Reconnaissance Ridge and this uh, seismic activity in that area. At the moment, there is no chance for volcanic activity there. We pick up this seismic activity because we have a, uh, placed our seismic stations there and there is no GPS station, but we know that there is no magma at the moment. At least. We have several big uh, earthquakes in the Atlantic Ocean, in the what is called the Reconnaissance Ridge. It is uh, underwater earthquakes on the ridge of the land, which is created when the Mid-Atlantic Ridge uh, split the Eurasia from the North America. The extension of this land, when it comes at the surface, is called Reconnaissance Peninsula. And you can see to the left, we have the North America, and the right uh, um, is, is the Eurasia. Here you can see in the form of topography. Uh, Iceland has been created at the middle. You see Scandinavia in the top uh, uh, right and the UK in the middle of the uh, near the center right. This is where this uh, split is happening. And this split and the cracks are uh, creating these earthquakes. The land is extended. The earth lithosphere is extended there. It's ex spreading and this is spreading creates this uh, new land by the magma coming up because the pressure is removed. We, in other poor points, uh, parts of the planet Earth, we have collision, those red parts. Here we have the extension. If you look into the, into the Earth mantle, you can see the effect of this land being subducted and the mantle plume coming up, creating new land also. The Earth crust at this area, Reconnaissance Ridge, uh, is not more than five kilometers thick. The depth of the earthquake was 10 kilometers, so that we can say safely it was in the mantle or the top of the part of the mantle where this split is happening on the land. We will have earthquakes like what we saw in the Fagodesville in 2021, then followed by eruption. We can conclude that these earthquakes, if they happen in the Reconnaissance Ridge, we can also have similar underwater uh, eruptions there and uh, the situation is really interesting we are lucky we see that on the land in the uh, Iceland at the moment it's happening at the bottom of the ocean everybody is now looking at the figure that's your volcano they look at the cameras they look at the charts tremors harmonic tremors earthquakes movements of the magma 3d models of it to see when this little volcano will erupt on land it is not going to erupt that quick. As you can see, the eruption is a little bit uh, delayed. What is more important is that uh, uh, another volcano may erupt. That is the LD volcano system. This is part of the mid-Atlantic ridge, which r reaches the land and the Reconnaissance Peninsula. 
This is now in eruption mode. This is the middle part. You saw the 3D model of it. Huge earthquakes, 4.2. And this is a little island, just a peak of a, one of those uh, ridges of the Middle Atlantic Ridge poking out of the ground. Probably uh, part of a fault line dropped down. This is a scary part. This is called Reckonist Ridge. It extends for thousands of kilometers down toward the south. The, what we saw in the figure, that's why in 2022 was just a little bit of it. The rest of it is under the water in the ocean, part of the Reckonus Ridge. This volcano actually may erupt sooner than the figure that's real. We have, we have to keep, keep an eye on that one. This is more likely to open and create a volcano maybe under the water. We have to wait and see.